Good afternoon, my lovers. Right, I'm heading back out to the field where I found some silver. Ah, some silver. I'm hoping to find some more silver and possibly gold. Because this is a really old house. It's got to be uh, late 1500s, 1600s, something like that. Really old. Well, not really, really old, but uh, old for a house. So I'm hoping to find some proper treasure today. I'm going back there with the CTX because this field's not much good for the GPX because there's no real old stuff there. You know, there's old, but 1500s, 1600s, it's not that old. So I don't think it's going to be very good for the GPX. So yeah, so let's see if we can find some more silver. Woohoo! Oh, I've just made it, my lovers. I've just made it. I got a pesky puncher on my bicycle. I'm gonna have to get a lift to go home. <laughs> they put this special green stuff in the wheel to stop the puncher, stop it from going flat. But I had some spokes redone because some spokes came undone. And um, obviously they must have drained that stuff because it's rapidly going flat after pumping it back up. Oh well, right. I got a lovely signal just here. Oh, what next? Should we see what it is? Oh, Twelve twenty-two. Mmm. Oh, I can see it. I can see it. Queen Victoria. Good day to you, Mum. Eighteen eighty one, it looks like. Yep. Right, off and running. On to the next. Look at this sweet signal I got here. Oh, I'll put money on that being a coin. Oh, he's bleeping on something. Just in here. Oh, there she blows. Is it a threepence? I think it's a threepence. It's a fizzly threepence. 1941 Fistly threepence Who's that on there then? Let's give it a rub on the magic trousers uh, uh, George the sixth methinks Right, on to the next Look at this sweet signal I got here Three. Yeah, I reckon it's going to be a coin. <laughs> oh, well, that's the impression. It's in here. Oh, there's the coin. There she blows. Oh, that looks different. It's a different looking one. Not sure it is a coin. Uh, is it a coin? Or is it another token? It's another chocolate box token. Woohoo! Right, I'm going to get this cleaned up and I'll get back to you. 
Oh, there she blows. Queen Victoria. Yes, lovely jubbly. Got a bunhead. Got some pearls. And on the back, it's a good big starburst with the crown in the middle. Right. Lovely jubbly. On to the next. Cool, I got a very nice signal just here. It's got sort of a strange kind of tone. I got like a really sort of clean sound. Oh, what's that? Gold? Oh, I can see it. It doesn't look gold, unfortunately. It popped out just down here. There she blows. Oh, good day to you, ma'am. Another Victoria. Eighteen sixty something. Let's give it a rub on the magic trousers. 63 uh, Yeah, I think it's 63 Right, lovely jubbly on to the next Oh, I got a nice signal just here It's got a bit of an iron grunt. It might be a bit of silver Be silver. Twelve thirty three. Let's get you closer to the action. No. Nope. Right in there. I can see it. No, it's not pesky silver. Ugh, just keep digging one coin after the other today. Oh, I got some pesky flies after me now. I have to put on some insect repellent. 1888. That was the year. On to the next. Oh, look at this signal I got here. Oh, don't know. Some gravel in the ground here. There must have been a courtyard or something. There's a little gate just over there. So I reckon it might have been a little, it's usually a good place to detect near gates. Oh, I reckon that got it. Oh, there it is. Oh, is it a whizzer? I think it's a whizzer. Yeah, that's what it is. Methinks, or was it they only have two holes? Yeah, it's a whizzer. You put string through it and it would spin, making a funny noise. If I had some string, we could try one out. Oh, there we go. 
Lovely jubbly, a little toy, probably quite old. On to the next. Well, this was a bit of a niffy signal. Sounds a lot better now though. Ooh, it's got a cut mark on it. Oh, there she blows, Britannia. Oh, 1775 again. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Must have been all the same uh, coins they used. All this, you know, one off mint. You see it on the bottom there? 1775? Yeah. Got a bit of a cut right through it there. Ugh, who's on here? Oh, that's a nice condition one for a change. Uh, there he is, King George the Third. His three eyes look. It's in really good condition. That one. That one's a bit deeper down because it was an iffy signal. Strange, got a cut mark through it. Right. On to the next. Look at this signal I got here. That nice bit of lead. Oh, I saw something drop. I saw something. Did I see something? Thought I did. Yeah. Perhaps it was a worm. Right, if I knocked it out then. Ah, there it is. It's just a little buckle. On to the next. Oh, I got a signal down here. Right there. Ground's a bit hard. Oh, that should have had it. He thinks. Oh, still down there. Deeper. Oh, there it is. It looks like an old buckle. Oh, yes. It is an old buckle. A nice old one. A little spectacle buckle. Yeah, not bad condition. Of course, there's probably thick clay down there. That's why. Right. Lovely jubbly. On to the next. Oh, that was a deep hole. I got a signal out, it's over here. Oh, I think I can see it. I can see it just there. Ooh. Who's this one going to be? Oh, I can see some writing. 
a bit of a it's been it's been whacked. It's been whacked. Oh, is that Queen Victoria? Yeah, I think it might be. Right, it's all encrusted. I'm gonna have to uh, give this one a scrub with the tough brush. Oh, there she blows. Good day to you, ma'am. In pretty good condition. See her hair? I think it's been driven over a few times because it's got a bit of a, a curve to it and it's all mangled. But uh, yeah, 1879. Right, on to the next. Ooh, look at this lovely signal I got here. Ooh, what's that? Oh, I can see it. I can see it. It's popped out. Not getting many buttons today, or coins. Hopefully this will be another one. Yep, yeah, another coin. Oh, this mud likes to stick on them. Oh, a bit of crustacean on the front. Right, I'm going to see if I can get this one cleaned up and I'll get back to you. Oh, there she blows. Good day to you, Mum. Yeah, a bit smoother this one. A bit of crustacean on there. 1861. Right, on to the next. Whoa, look at this signal I got here. Whoa, what's that? Kakapoo poo? Oh, what's that there? Uh, oh, it's, it's a fossil. Got lots of fossils in there. Thought that was it then, but now it's all fossils. Oh, it's in here. Is it? In? Oh, hold on. Is that it or is that it? That's a that's a rock. I think it's in. Oh, it is in here. It's in here. <laughs> oh, there she blows. Sticking out of the edge there. Look. It was all the coins today. Coins galore today. Oh, good day to you, ma'am. Another one. So we can get the date off this one without having to clean it. Right, we've got 1883, methinks. There on the bottom. Let's get a bit more of that mud off. 1883. Half penny. Right, on to the next. Oh, is that fossil? Well, lots of little fossils. It's like lots of little clams and stuff all mangled up. Nothing on the back. Just a bunch of fossils all squashed. Maybe some oyster shells from uh, 250 million years ago. Right, on to the next. Oh, that's it, me lovers. God, I've had all the coins today. Look, one, two, three, four, five, six half pennies. Uh, farthing, thrusten, a uh, fizzy thruppence, chocolate box token. Oh, I like this coin here. You can, this one came up really nice. Apart from the little bash in the corner there, that went in mint condition. And the date. Is 1775. Lovely jubbly. Look at that. Yeah, that one's good. And the chocolate box token. Good day to you, Mum. Yeah. Uh, Whizzer. Spectacle buckle. We looked that one up. 500 years old. Little D buckle. Probably Victorian. 20p, 5p spendable. For some reason, I keep finding lots of toothpaste tubes. Which is a bit odd. This is a piece of window glass. You know, the, the lead for the window. Uh, I don't know what that is. Old buckle, fossil. Not much today, but I want to get home early. Because I want to change my tyre on my bicycle. Get it ready for tomorrow, hopefully. 
It's going to be really hot though tomorrow. I might give it a miss. It's going to be 30 in the shade. Right. Oh, that's it, me lovers. I'm going to head off home now and uh, see if I can get my bike fixed or get the wheel off before it gets dark. So uh, I don't want to do it in the house, get the wheel off. Um, and then I'll be back out, probably not tomorrow because it's going to be really, really hot um, and humid as well. Ugh. So uh, I'll probably be back out the next day when it's supposed to cool off a bit. Cheers!